pulling pieces and pieces of Bondo out. Like, man, I put so much hardener in that thing. Hey guys and welcome back to another video. So I'm about to show you guys what happened yesterday with the bumper and why I did not upload the video last night or this morning because it was a disaster, all right? I messed it up, messed it up, I messed it up. We can just pull pieces of Bondo out so it didn't really stick and um, yeah. So I'm gonna have to redo it all over again. Just and it's just not working. I've really been juggling with these bumpers for months now and I just wanted to get it done perfectly but as you can see, nothing goes perfect in this world. All right, well. So let's get rid of some Bondo, shall we? Anyway, it was not my fault. It was the Bondo that we had fault. So today, we went to the garage and we fixed it. I'm not gonna put that in this video because it was way too long. So um, you guys are gonna get the end process, all right? Anyway, so I got rid of all the Bondo that we had put on there originally. Sent the whole bumper down to get rid of whatever Duraflex put on there. And then today we used some 3, 3M Bondo. I had up the bumper on the car and I built it up because on these edges right here, like I explained in the other video, they would go too far in under the tail lights, and you would be able to see the bottom of the tail lights just sticking out. So I put up against the car, we laid some Bondo, we built it up uh, to be nice and flush. And what I'm gonna be doing right now is setting it down, get it nice and smooth, um, because they pretty much there, it's pretty much there. And then whatever else I do in this video. Who knows? We'll see by the end of the video what we can do. But right now, let's get worked on that. And please, watch it all the way through. And hey, it's time to grind, all right? Let's get going. All right, guys, so I'm gonna use some 220 here. Um, just moving this edge out and get rid of the um, built-up overlay and make it nice and flush through, all right? So I'm gonna start with that.
So I use the DA sender. Let me bring you guys a little bit closer in so you guys can see. Let me bring you guys a closer in so you guys can see what I have done. So I smoothen it out to where you can see where it needs to be redone and built up. Right there. And if you guys can see right over here, this edge is where I had to build down and um, make it a little chunky right there so um, it can be built up under the tail light. Same thing with this side. Uh, I feel like it's a little bit smoother. But yeah. Alright, so now I'm about to put some Bondo in those spots because there is little grooves in there. Um, so I'm about to fill that up with some Bondo and then we can smooth it out again and finalize it, alright? Let's get to it. Alright guys, second trial with this. Bondo, hardener, about to mix it all up. Alright guys, I'm gonna go ahead and sing down what I just did and see what happens. Let's see if it worked this time. Alright you guys, as you can see I'm covered in um, freaking bondo residue I guess, but so far we were able to smoothen it all out, um, I'm just getting out the tough corners trying to feather it all out, almost done, but hey, uh, I think I got it down to where it needs to be to fit on the headlight, and I can hand it off to Carlos, and he can throw uh, one more coat of putting to fill in the tiny little holes uh, since he's the professional around here and yeah he can fill the little tiny holes that are there and then we can get it ready for primer and then ready for paint and then we're going to be painting this and we're going to be painting the other front bumper all right so yeah this is where we stand thank you so much for watching this video thank you guys for subscribing Please, if you're not subscribed, make sure you hit the subscribe button. Make sure you hit the like button if you enjoyed this video, if you're learning something. 
and also hit the notification bell so you don't miss any more videos coming out on this channel and also make sure to go head over to Altarki Designs link is in the description show him some love too all right and again thank you everybody thank you so much and i'll see you guys in the next one <laughs>